All right, early childhood education. You got to visit the elementary schools, most of us, and, uh, and then I think we're going to talk a little bit more. Dr. Zalas, do no, you have a little actually, more to share or not? I actually, I moved the uh, timeline to where when Rick Nobles was here oh, from Patron right. Insights, mm -hmm. so I'll save you from redundant to presentation. Mm -hmm. So just. But you've made some time. more public presentations since we last met, I, I believe. I was at Parent Advisory Committee last night at junior high. I've been to the <coughs> middle school. I'm uh, scheduled to go to Mark Twain next Tuesday at 6 for their PTO. And then uh, I'm on the chamber docket for March, but that's down the line. Didn't so you meet with some Rotarians? I met with, yeah, I did. Breakfast <laughs> Rotary Club. Thank you for <laughs> <laughs> Breakfast Rotary Club uh, two weeks ago on Monday morning at 7. So, so you've been busy with that. Yeah, just make trying to help people understand what we've been doing over the last uh, several months in preparation for uh, planning for early childhood expansion and other programming and improvements. So. You may have already asked uh, Director Lombardi, can we get his permission to clip that presentation out and post I did, it? I did, Perfect. Yeah. I told him he'll be on TV and <laughs> streamed live and all those good things, and on Twitter as well. So. Good. Thank you. I thought the uh, visits to the elementary schools was very, very good. It was good for me to get out there mm -hmm. and see uh, what they're doing and, and uh, see their needs as well Busy as places. the neat things they're doing. Anybody else have anything comments about it? those visits we enjoyed school lunch enjoyed school lunch <laughs> yeah i thought it was good lunch good conversation with the little ones yep <laughs> it is part of what you said at the, you know, part of our retreat governance discussion too that we would get out into the buildings more mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. i think it was mentioned that you'd like to do it at the secondary level yeah yeah absolutely uh, as well and, and so we can plan for that as for maybe in the second semester yep. Certainly got a lot going on now, uh, and it's going to mm -hmm. ramp up uh, here in the next four weeks or so. so. Well, and as we move forward, I think it's going to be good for us to get out and talk with some of the school folks. Uh, uh, yep. They may have some concerns, and be good to meet with them. So. And for me, it was uh, good to see firsthand what the teachers were dealing with in kindergarten, teaching kindergarten now versus then when I was there yeah. a long time mm -hmm. ago. Yeah. <laughs> so. They have paper now. <laughs> well, I think seeing the uh, early childhood class at, uh, at Wyman was, I hadn't really seen those kids mm -hmm. uh, both in the gym and in the classroom. So that, I think that was really interesting to see that that population that we're going to start to try to serve. Yeah. We were given a tour at uh, Mark Twain by, I can't remember, was the youngest, was she a kindergarten or first grade? I cannot remember. I was a first grader. Um, oh, it was And Sarah. then a third grader and a fourth grader. Ben. Was, was she, the littlest, was she a, fir a first grader or kindergarten? <coughs> I cannot remember. I think she was a first grader. The little was boy first? was a fourth grader. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the girl was a third grader. The other girl. Because it was Missouri days when we were there. That was yeah. fun. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's fun. It's great. Back to Ben.